Hello friends, let us continue with redemption of debentures, right? Now in this we have been discussing about methods of redemption and in the last lecture we did the practical problems on method one that is redemption on maturity in lump sum right so this is what we discussed in the last lecture we did this we did some practical problems on this right methods of redemption redemption on maturity in lump sum right now in this lecture we are going to do the second method for this that is redemption in installments by draw of lots in the first case there was lump sum payment and in this case there is payment in installments by draw of lots see on 1 4 2016 you issued 1 lakh debentures rupees 1 lakh debentures right and these debentures were issued as 30,000 debentures to A 20,000 to B then 20,000 to C 10,000 to D how much it is 80 then 20,000 to E right so this is how the debentures were issued 30,000 to A 20,000 to B 20,000 to C 10,000 to D and 20,000 to E this is rupees 1 lakh right then the company decided that in this year there will be no redemption then they say on 30th of September 17 we want to redeem 50,000 debentures right company says we want to redeem 50,000 debentures to be redeemed right now how they will decide this 50,000 because there are five debenture holders now to whom this payment of 50,000 will be made this is what they have to decide for that they say we will take out a draw draw just like a lucky draw they will put the chits with the name of a b c and d they will take out a draw on 30th of September and whose name is there they will pay accordingly 50,000 clear then what will happen then on 31st of March 2018 they want to redeem another 10,000 again to whom the payment is to be made that will be decided by draw they will draw the chits just like lucky draw so whosoever name will be there he will be the lucky person right draw of lots draw of lots right and then on 30th September 2018 they again say we want to redeem the balance 40,000 debentures again right either by draw or by that time they will know to whom the payment is to be made so this is redemption in installments by draw of lots clear 
This is how we do redemption in installments by draw of lots. Clear? So let us do a practical problem on this and you will have more clarity from that. Okay. ABC Limited issued 1510% debentures of 1000 each at par on 1st of April 2014 which are redeemable in three equal half yearly installments right by draw of lots beginning 30th September 2015 the company complied with the requirements of Companies Act 2013 with respect to debenture redemption reserve and investment pass journal entries assuming the investment was in cash each time the debentures were redeemed clear it is a very simple question but the only thing important here is DRI let us see why creation of DRI will be important in this right Let's start. Let's draw the diagram first. On 1 4 2014, they have issued 1500 debentures of rupees 1000 each. That is, they have issued 15 lakh rupees debentures. Right? Now, this year will close on 31st of march 2015 is there any transaction in this period no because the redemption is to start from 30th of september 2015 we are at 31st of march 2015 what you have to do here you have to create drr right the question doesn't talk about the interest payment then we will ignore interest the question has specifically given ignore interest right so in this year, we'll just create DRR. Then this year started, next financial year started. On 30th of September 2015, he says debentures are to be redeemed. How much debentures to be redeemed? Out of 15 lakh, 15 lakh is the total amount of debentures issued. These are to be redeemed in three equal half yearly installments right that is 5 lakh in each installment so on 30th september what is the amount to be redeemed 5 lakh rupees debentures to be redeemed now how this will be identified to whom we have to make a payment of 5 lakhs that will be by draw of lots clear by lucky draw right then next half year when this half year is going to end 31st of march 2016 here again you have to redeem 5 lakh debentures debentures to be redeemed right how much is left out of 15 lakh by the next year you have redeemed 10 lakh rupees and in the next half that is on 30th of September 16 you will redeem the remaining 5 lakh rupees debentures to be redeemed right now what are the transactions you will take in this period what are the transactions that you will take in this period? This is one financial year from 1st one one of April 15 to 31st March 16. This is one financial year. One here is there is redemption. So we'll pass journal entries related to redemption. And I told you for the debentures which are redeemable in the financial year, what you have to do? You have to create you have to invest in the specified securities. We have to create DRI. DRI is minimum 15% of face value of debentures to be redeemed. 
now this word is important face value of debentures to be redeemed because what are what is the amount of debentures that are being redeemed in this year 5 lakh plus 5 lakh that is 10 lakh rupees right so in this financial year on or before 30th of april 2015 we have to invest in the securities specified securities and it will be 15% of 10 lakh rupees and not 15 lakh rupees this is important right because we have to create dri for the debentures that are redeemable in that particular financial year this is out of financial year this is for the next financial year in this 15 16 financial year we are redeeming 10 lakh rupees so dri investment will be 15% of 10 lakh and not 15 lakhs this is important here right and for this 5 lakhs which is in the next financial year we will create dri on or before 30th of april 16 this will be 15% of 5 lakh clear remember these words dri is to be created on the debentures which are redeemable in that particular financial year right in 15 16 financial year how much debentures are redeemable 5 lakh plus 5 lakh 10 lakh this is the only important point in this right so let us start with the journal entries on 14 2014 you have received applications you will say bank account debit to debenture application account right this comes to 15 lakh then debenture application account debit to 10% debentures account that comes to 15 lakh right now anything on this date more no we should debentures in this financial year at the end of the financial year we will create drr on 31st of march 2015 we will pass entry for drr that is surplus account debit to drr account now this has to be what is the number of debentures issued 15 lakh minimum 25% so question until and unless otherwise specified you have to create at the minimum rate 3 lakh 75000 clear now next next you have to make investment in the specified securities on or before 30th of april because in this financial year we have 10 lakh debentures that are redeemable so entry will be say we invested on 30th for 15 we'll say debenture redemption investment account debit to bank account on 10 lakh debentures which are redeemable in the current financial year you will create dri at the rate of 15% that is 1 lakh 50000 1 lakh 50000 right now on 30th of september you have to redeem debentures 5 lakh rupees now regarding the dri the question says investments were in cashed each time the debentures were redeemed now we created dri for 10 lakh debentures but on 30th of september we are redeeming 
5 lakh only so if we are in cashing on 30th of september before the redemption we have to in cash investments bank account debit to debenture now will you in cash the whole of investments no you cannot in cash the whole of investments because this 5 lakh is to be redeemed on 31st march you are standing on 30th of september 15 so you will in cash investments to the extent of 5 lakh debentures only right how much 75000 you can in cash you cannot in cash the remaining investments because you have to in cash it just before the redemption right then on 30th september we have to redeem for that we will say 10 percent debentures account debit to debenture holders account 5 lakh and 5 lakh debenture holders account debit to bank account 5 lakh and 5 lakh clear this is for the redemption now now we come to 31st of march 2016 First of all, we will in cash the remaining investments of 75,000. 31st of March 16. Bank account debit to debenture redemption investment account. Here we will redeem the remaining investments. We cannot redeem on 30th of September because on 30th we are redeeming 5 lakh only whereas investment is done on 10 lakh rupees. So to the extent the debentures are redeemable or redeemed just before the redemption in cash the investments to that extent. Then we have to pay to the debenture holders 10% debentures to debenture holders 5 lakh and 5 lakh then debenture holders account debit to bank account again 5 lakh now now we have completed till this point right now there is only one lot that is left that is to be redeemable on 30th of september 2016 now in this financial year we have a redemption of debentures so we have to create dri again we have to invest in specified securities on or before 30th of april 2016 so let's create that 30th of april 16 what we are going to do is debenture redemption investment account debit to bank account now what will be the amount the amount of debentures redeemable in that particular financial year multiplied by minimum rate that is 15 percent this comes to 75,000 and 75,000 now on the date of redemption you will in cash these investments bank account debit to debenture redemption investment account 75000 you are in cashing the investment right before the redemption then 
will redeem the debentures 10% debentures account debit to debenture holders how much 5 lakh and then we'll pay to the debenture holders for that we'll say debenture holders account debit to bank account 5 lakh and 5 lakh now is now here the redemption has closed we have redeemed 15 lakh debentures anything else left yes on this date you will transfer the balance in drr drr account debit to general reserve after redemption whatever the balance is there in the drr that will be transferred to general reserve clear so with this we complete draw of lots always remember this picture always draw this picture this will definitely help you right so the important point here in this question to remember is that on what amount you have to create dri of 15 percent on the amount of debentures that are redeemable in that particular financial year or accounting year financial year here i want to say is 1 4 15 to 31st of march 16 financial year and accounting year are the same in this case okay right clear this is one important point that is to be remembered in this question i hope this is clear friends redemption in installments by draw of lots so we have done the question on this so if you have any queries just send me an email at ksj teaching at the rate of gmail.com right in the next lecture what we are going to do is we are going to start with method 3 that is redemption by purchase of own debentures from open market right redemption by purchase of own debentures from open market this is the next topic that we are going to cover in the next lecture so that's all for this lecture friends thank you so much